Hi, my name is Troy Beekel. I'm with the Grower Services Department of Premier Tech. Today I want to talk to you about the Promix BX. Promix BX is an all-purpose growing media that basically uh, serves the majority of your growing media needs. It's really the most popular product we have with both the ornamental and also the vegetable market. It's been established in the commercial horticulture market for more than 50 years. So the applications for the Promix BX, you can use it for various crops such as flowering annuals, perennials, microgreens, you can use it for cannabis, and even in some cases, uh, even some simple outdoor applications for mums or maybe even uh, some trees or shrubs. Some growers have actually used it for even seed germination as long as the seeds are a larger size such as tomatoes and peppers and grown in 72 cell size packs or bigger. As far as the other crops we mentioned, you can use any pot size you want. Anything from, for instance, cell packs, pots, hanging baskets, large planters, anything will, will work with the Promix BX. Now Promix BX is formulated with 80 to 85% Canadian sphagnum peat moss, perlite, which is used to introduce better drainage and more aeration in the growing media. We also add a wetting agent to help the peat moss, which is naturally hydrophobic to wet with water. We also add calcitic and dolomitic limestone to bring the pH up in the range of about 5.2 to 6.2. However, most of the time the pH usually lands somewhere between 5.4 and 5.9. And the last thing is we add a starter fertilizer charge, which lasts about seven days. Now the features of our Promix BX, it has a high water holding capacity, so that can help reduce the amount of watering a grower would have to do. So it saves money on that. Uh, it also saves a little bit more on labor. And it also has a, a good air space into it, a good uh, air process. So in, in times of low light growing conditions, it can also be used for those purposes as well. So Promix BX comes in three active ingredient options. The first one, which would be the Promix BX Mycorrhizae. The second is Promix BX Biofungicide plus Mycorrhizae. And the third would be the standard Promix. So a little bit about the active ingredients. First of all, Mycorrhizae is a natural endomycorrhizal fungi, which helps to acquire water and nutrients, particularly phosphorus, copper, manganese, zinc, as well as other elements, to bring them back from, basically take it from the outer areas of the growing meter where the plant roots are present and bring it back into the plant roots to help feed the plant. The second uh, active ingredient we use is a biofungicide, which is a natural bacterium called Bacillus pumilus PTB180. It colonizes roots very rapidly within 48 hours. In the process, it forms a biofilm around the root system, which makes it difficult for plant pathogens to actually penetrate that and cause infection. The other thing that the biofungicide does is it produces a polypeptide, which is a natural fungicide that helps suppress root disease organisms such as Fusarium, Pythium, and Rhizoctonia. The bottom line is by being able to reduce the, uh, the disease load on the crop, it will save you money and also reduce the need for fungicide drenches through a maintenance program. Now the benefits, first of all, the Promix BX is an easy to use product. It serves a wide range of crops and various applications, as we mentioned earlier. It does help to improve the overall quality and uniformity of your crop because it's basically formulated in such a way that it's superior to what you'd find in normal, let's say, you know, some uh, locally produced product. Promix BX is also quality tested. So it's consistent from bale to bale, from season to season. So you know it's going to be uniform and work well for you. And if you also have the addition of the biofungicide and the mycorrhizae, you're going to get a labor savings. It'll also save you on the cost of applying the fungicide drenches. And you can get easier crop management because you don't have to worry about these root diseases. You'll get natural suppression of that. And there's no need to reapply either the biofungicide or the mycorrhizae. So some of the tips we recommend when using the Promix BX is number one, begin fertilization within seven days. Choose a fertilizer that considers the water quality. So you're looking at testing the water, looking at the alkalinity and the nutrients provided or not provided uh, by the actual water itself. And keep in mind the starter fertilizer charges in the Promix BX will be consumed by natural microorganisms over time. So at nine months of age after manufacturing, you may have to give it a little extra feed just to, 
just to reinstate the, the starter fertilizer charge. However, we do really recommend using the Promix BX within nine to 12 months after manufacturing, just in case there is that loss of starter fertilizer charge and also wetting agent. And I wanna thank you for listening.